Hello everyone, Google has just made Nano Banana significantly more powerful with its Gemini 3 upgrade and it opens up capabilities that simply weren't possible before. If you regularly handle data, research, reports or even rough notes, this model will change the way you work. In this video, I'm going to walk you through some amazing use cases that show you exactly what the new Nano Banana can do. You'll see how it can transform text, data, and mixed visuals into clear, structured outputs and visuals in seconds. So let's get started. So for our first use case, we want to turn these rough participant insights into a clean customer journey map. Right now, the feedback is messy and unstructured, which makes it hard to see patterns or clearly explain the experience. So the first thing we're going to do is copy the notes exactly as they are and paste them in. Then we add this prompt, generate a participant journey map image based on these notes. We also select create images and then generate. And here is the final output it produced from the notes. So look at the output here. You can see how it's taken a set of completely unstructured structured notes and organize them into a clear participant experience. On the left, it's created an emotional axis from high to low, so you can immediately see where the experience improves and where it drops. From there, it reads through everything, identifies the key touch points, and pulls out the emotional highs and lows. It then lays the whole journey out visually with clear stages, labels, icons, and a flow that's easy to follow. I love how it groups the comments into stages like pre-program, onboarding, participation, assessment, and completion. It highlights the positive positive moments such as early excitement, helpful feedback and visible progress. And it also clearly shows the dips like login issues, unclear communication, changing deadlines, scattered resources and the stress before final presentations. Overall, this gives you a clear, shareable view of the participant experience that would normally take a lot of manual sorting and design work to produce. So for the next use case, we're going to create professional product images that we can use in research reports or formal documents. We're starting with a very basic product photo of this smartwatch, just taken on a phone with a busy background and uneven lighting. We upload the image into Gemini and add this prompt, change this product photo into a high quality studio style image and give it a clean modern look suitable for the cover of a research report. Again, we select create images and then generate. If you look at the output, you can see how it's taken the exact same smartwatch and presented it in a professional studio style setting. The background is neutral, the lighting is even, and the product is clearly the focus. It's also added a report title and the placement works well visually alongside the product. It clearly frames the image as part of a research report. We can also add a follow-up prompt. Now keep the same product exactly, but give me different angles for the executive summary page and one for the product features page. Again, you'll see the product stays exactly the same, but the angles change to suit different sections. One image works well for an executive summary, while the other focuses more on product features. This gives you consistent visuals across your report. So for our third use case, we will take a data set and turn it into a single dashboard that clearly shows the main patterns, trends, and relationships in the data. So the first thing we'll do is upload the data set into Gemini and use this prompt, create a dashboard image that brings together several charts summarizing the key patterns in the attached data set. Style the dashboard with a theme that fits the tone and context of the data. Select create images and generate. And look at this output. So it's analyzed the entire data set, identified what's important, and decided how best to visualize it. It selects appropriate chart types, groups related insights together, and lays everything out as a coherent multi-panel dashboard with a consistent visual theme. You can see how it brings together trends, comparisons, distributions, and regional patterns into one clear view. Overall, this gives you a complete presentation-ready overview of the data in minutes. For this use case, we want to take a long text heavy methodology section and visualize the steps in a way that's easy to understand and easy to present. We'll start by copying the full methodology section directly from a research paper. We paste the text into Gemini, then upload a reference image to show the layout and visual style we want to follow. Next, we add this prompt, create a visual showing the methodology used below in the style of the reference image, select create images and then generate. So look at the output here. You can see how it's taken a long technical methodology and broken it down into clear sequential steps that are easy to follow. When you compare this to the reference image, you can see how closely the style has been matched. The structure is the same, the color scheme is consistent, the icons follow the same style, and the overall flow mirrors the reference layout. 
What's important is that Nano Banana isn't just summarizing the methodology, it's applying the visual logic of the reference image directly to the content, so the result feels intentional and professionally designed. Overall, this turns a dense methodology section into a clear, presentation-ready visual without having to manually design it from scratch, which is incredibly useful for students, researchers, and academics. For this use case, we're looking at how Nano Banana can maintain character consistency across images, which is important when you're creating manuals, guides, or internal training materials. You want the same character to appear consistently, so the experience reads as one continuous story. So in this example, we want to create an employee onboarding journey told through a short visual sequence, one that shows progression and growing confidence over time. To do that, we add this prompt into Gemini, generate a cinematic three-image sequence showing an employee onboarding journey, use the same employee in the same workspace with the same camera angle, lighting and environment so the character and scene remain consistent across all images. Then we give it the detailed instructions for each step and generate. So let's look at the output. You can see it's maintained the visual consistency across the sequence. The character remains consistent across all three images with the same features, clothes, and overall visual style. The environment is also kept consistent. The office setting, camera angle, lighting, and desk setup remain the same throughout, which helps the sequence feel coherent rather than like a set of disconnected images. What changes is the context and the activity. In the first image, the character is navigating the initial onboarding materials. In the second, she is actively engaged engaging with the team, and in the third, she is confidently presenting and contributing. This use case is very effective if you want to create onboarding or training scenarios where you want to show progression over time without breaking visual consistency. For this use case, we want to take several separate strategic visuals and combine them into one clear high-level concept map, so instead of having insights spread across multiple diagrams, we can see how everything fits together. So we start by uploading our three images, a supply chain process diagram, a market positioning quadrant, and a revenue loop showing growth and reinvestment. Then we add this prompt, use the three uploaded images, create a single high-level strategic concept map that unifies these three systems. We give it some information on the structure and the style, and then we generate. Now, if you look at the output, you can see how everything has been pulled together into one coherent visual. The three systems are no longer disconnected. They now read as a single strategic story, moving from operations to positioning to outcomes. All elements have been redrawn in the same flat modern style, using a unified blue and slate gray color palette. Overall, this use case is incredibly useful when you need to align different perspectives into one shared view, whether that's for executive discussions, strategy decks, or teaching complex systems. So for this next use case, we want to take a set of charts that have come from different sources with different styles, colors, and fonts, and make them look like they belong together in a single report or presentation. So first we'll upload our four charts, then we'll add this prompt, standardize these figures to have a pure white background, Arial font for labels, and a consistent blue and gray color scheme. Now, if you look at the output, you can see that it comes back with four consistent charts, or it's kept the exact same data, but the backgrounds are clean and white, the fonts are consistent, the colors are unified, and the overall look feels coherent and professional. Instead of four unrelated charts, you now have a set of visuals that can sit side by side, all done in a single simple step. For this use case, we want to take a financial report full of tables, figures, and written summaries and turn it into a single visual dashboard that highlights the key insights at a glance. So we'll upload the financial report into Gemini, then we add a simple prompt, create a dashboard image showing the key insights from the attached financial report. Again, let's select generate images, then we generate. Now look at the output. You can see how Nano Banana has pulled out the most important metrics and trends and organized them into a clean, structured dashboard. The key figures sit clearly at the top. The supporting charts are placed underneath. Instead of scrolling through pages of numbers, you get a single visual view that shows performance, trends, and comparisons almost immediately. What would normally take hours of analysis and design is reduced to a single prompt and a dashboard that's ready to use. So that brings us to the end of this video. What these use cases really show is that Nano Banana isn't just generating visuals, it's doing the thinking and structuring work for you. It takes raw notes, data, 
documents, and even mixed or messy visuals and turns them into outputs that are organized, readable, and presentation ready. If you spend a lot of time working with reports, research, presentations, or complex workflows, this can genuinely change how quickly you move from raw material to something clear, polished, and easy to communicate. I hope you found this useful, and I'll see you in the next one.